Hey everyone, Brian here, welcome to this video. And this is the Koth King of the Hill Season 5 Finale, and we're facing Mr. Ryan Mahalik. Now, let me tell you a bit of the history about Koth winners. So, um, Sub to PewDiePie won Season 1, Season 2 was won by Bendover, aka King. And season three and four were won by Mr. Brian Jess, me. Um, in the in the season three final, I played Mr. Ryan Mahalik, and it was a pretty close series. We went three two. Um, three two indeed. I was three, he was two. But he did choke that game on inlets. So, so I suppose we'll see here what will happen. So the starter map is random, decided by the bot. Where boats go in Dartland Farm Bomb, it seems like. I'm not too sure why he's playing so aggro. This isn't well, actually, uh, but I think my way is is better than his, since we'll be out farming. Since lives don't really matter late game. It's all about the early BIA moment. Okay, so I'm gonna upgrade to my powerful darts. By the way, this is a post commentary. Since I had to do um, full tryhard mode on, on Mr. Ryan Mahalik. I don't think he was recording either. He'll do a post commentary on his channel. I'll leave his, I'll leave his channel in the description. I think he has two channels. One's a locksmith. Actually, no, that's fake Ryan Mahalik. But Ryan Mahalik is his real name. So he's never upgraded his powerful dart, so he upgrades his plantation. But as you can see here, I did a really big brain play since um, I don't end round four. So he won. He doesn't get any extra bananas from his plantation. And two, we get the bananas from the plantation at the same time. So we have a really healthy live lead at the moment, which will be Faisal later on. And we're also even in farms. I'm just stalling the rounds quite slightly. Yep, yeah, I'm just slightly uh, slightly ahead in farms. As you can see that I upgraded my m more bananas faster than he did. So I'd say we're out playing at the moment. Like, even though you may think that the game is like very even it's actually not really since since when you get to that high competitive sweatiness of cop everything matters so i'm sending him black since he's low on lives he goes for his bomb shooter and he's leaking more lives so he never sent me any blacks which i think is a misplay on his part also, I'm going to force his cluster here, and he's trying to force mine. He's bloom boosting it actually, so I'm going to bloom boost it at him, and we both have to boost now. I'm just I'm just going to boost, and he boosts too actually, but he had bad dartling and bomb targeting, so he went down even with boost. Yeah, he's just... Gold sheep just beat Ryan 2-0. Okay, that's embarrassing. I think Ryan's tilting right now. But I think here's a big difference since I since when I played this game I haven't played BTD in like two to three days. But Ryan has been steadily grinding caught like three to five games a day. Like his elo at the moment is um, is like close to 1900s and mine's only 1600s. And yeah, I don't really think playing too many games is healthy. I suppose it does increase your consistency, uh, but I think taking breaks 
the game is a bit better. Since, since, since otherwise, if you play t too many cough games, you'll get um, too infested in the game. So when you lose, you'll rage really hard. And if you rage, you're obviously not enjoying the game. Which is why I don't rage in my... Like, I never rage in BTD. Since, like, I don't really invest too much time in it. Well, actually, I do. But it, it's, like, for fun. I don't really expect anything. But we're both playing for, um... Season 5 winner. So, yeah. That's why... That's why I suppose we're trying. So, in dart lane, I'm gonna boost this to force his, um, powerful darts. We sh should be out farming now, as we got, like, two extra bananas from our 1-0 thingy. Um, yeah. So, I'm gonna upgrade to my plantation exactly on round 5, which will... And he misses his plantation, since he's behind in farms. So... I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna get seven bananas, which is four hundred and twenty dollars, and he's only guessing like less. So I'm like up in money now, so I'm out playing. Um, yeah, I'm replacing down another farm, which which gives me one hundred and eighty dollars per that round, and he only gets one, so we gain another one hundred twenty dollars. So we're kind of out playing so i'm pretty happy with this and since he has 150 lives and all his spikes i am not going to um send him blacks and there's also a really long map unlike blaster also i, I forgot to mention he banned engineer and i banned tack i banned tack since my losing map is steps and he likes to go really annoying eco there so i just um ban his ego strategies since they're just annoying to play against so he's so so to be honest i think he outplayed me here sure he leaks a loss but he forces my boost so i think yeah that's a misplay on my part so he's gone for his second dartlin but here i think he blunders he sells his bomb, he buys a Darlin, and then he sells his Darlin. He he loses 80% of his cash when he sells something. So this, yeah, and we have way more ego than he does. Yeah, yeah. I think that was a misplay on his part. He should have just boosted and out farmed, since we'll be even in boosts then. So right now I'm probably up like 100 ego. He has more defense than me, which is why um he's, which is why my ego is high. But we're similar in farms. We both upgrade to our Bluntonium, and he actually doesn't have a spike down there. That's just lag, darling glitch. And he tries to force my cluster, but I don't budge. I think that's another misplay on his part, since he wasted money ecoing. So now we're pretty much tied in eco, but I'm up w one whole plantation. But I think he does have some cash in hand though, since he's gonna upgrade to uh, Republic. I am I immensely disagree with that play, since farms are only worth this two rounds after. So if he goes for a Republic, and he also misses out on his plantation around 14 bananas, so um. Yeah, I don't think that's smart, unless he's planning on round 17 BIA. But I'm simply gonna go round 15 BIA, and he can't follow it up, since he's rushing me with some bad rushes. So, um... Yeah. So, on round 16, I cash out my BIA for some dartlands, and that's totally fine, since I'm gonna need these dartlands if he sends me a mob round 18. Also, the fact that... I got like an extra 
15 i mean ac eco from that bia which is worth like which is worth three thousand dollars the eco from the bia is huge not gonna lie so i'm gonna send him a bleem beast and mob mob since he's kept on sending me leads and blacks so he has to boost this but even with the boost i think he's probably dead yeah he's probably dead I think he cashes out his BIA as well, I'm not sure though. He boosts when the mob is at the end. Uh, I'm honestly not too sure what went wrong for him. Uh, I think it was that he kept on rushing me instead of just farming. And to be honest, I don't think Ryan um, did that since he was bad. I think since he's been playing more arenas and Koth now, I think he wants fast games, so he tries. So he tries to make me joke. It's kind of like how Subdue PewDiePie plays. Yeah, and now we're just joking about him account sharing since. He normally plays a lot better than this. So his loser map is inlets. Again. Again, Hoopin and I banned this. And Ryan also banned in season six this season. So um I'm happy about so I'm happy about that. Oh yeah, and on the screen you can see that Ryan's elo is only 17,000, but at the time I'm recording this, it's like 1875 Yeah, maybe his Wi-Fi was bad, so he just wanted to end the game fast. I'm not sure Yeah, that's pretty unlucky. I remember when I had my old PC I kept on freezing Anyway, he picked inlet which is a really boring map. I just hate playing it now. Yeah, it's just BIA spam. I don't even think I'm gonna... Actually, yeah, I'm just gonna put it in the video anyway. Since, um, my subscribers, such as Reed, Raid, I don't know how to pronounce his name, but... And others, not just him, have been complaining about boring inlet BIA games. So I'm not too sure if I'm gonna, um... Keep this in or not. I think, I, I think I'm gonna snip this here. I'm gonna sniff it. And also, this has a really anti anticlimactic and ending when when Ryan Mahalik just DCs at oh, spoilers, sorry, but Ryan does DC, and that since um, I'm on PC, I have a new PC. It's only two hundred dollars, but like it's still a new PC. It's an i7. So, and even though BTD only only runs on one core, if it comes down to a contest of lag, obviously a PC is gonna last longer than than his phone. Even though it's an iPhone, I think I'm not sure. So I'm not too sure why Ryan picked that this map. Like, even if he does outplay me, he's still gonna lag out. So I don't really understand that at all. So he goes for a mortar, I just go for my series or a boast. Um, I'm gonna put this in first. And I'm gonna sell my boast. And, the, and the, the difference with with what I did and what he did was that I have way more lives by simply going for a boat since he sent me for, um since I sent him more blacks he shouldn't have gone for his mortar so he sent me yellows pretty good play but at the moment he does outplay me but I'm not really interested into how he outplayed me anymore since it's inlets and Inlets is a banned map now from like all servers So I'm kind of not interested in playing inlets anymore. I'm not interested in analyzing it either 
I'm more interested in maps like Swan Lake and, and and Ghostly Coast. Ghostly Coast I find really interesting actually. So I'm gonna spice piece some whites. And farm on. Sun and white is probably a mistake though. Yeah, since he just out farms me. Yeah, so I have like 200 more equal than him. But it means nothing if he gets up his BAA before me. So I'm looking for around, for around 15 BAA maybe. So he's outplaying me a lot now. Yep, so we go for his BIA. And I'm gonna go for mine. I honestly don't think it matters if we have infinite money like game. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna end this in this game as it's so boring. Nothing happens, like, we just spam BIAs, spam aircrafts, he DCs. I'm gonna end this maybe. Yup, it's really boring. Yawn, yawn, yawn. Yeah, I think I, I think I'm gonna um, dispose the the rest of the inlets section completely since it's boring and it has a bad ending. So I'm gonna dispose this up to here where he does lag out since we spam aircrafts and we have 5000 eco max aircrafts yeah it's, it's just lag and yeah it's slowing down it's slowing down and he does lag out Okay, yeah, so it's freezing anti lags out. Um, yeah, okay. Boring. And this is why we banned inlets from COD. It's just boring, man. And everyone just lags out. So I just um, clipped that bit out. And. Just ignore Ryan's messages. Even though he did outplay me, he is the one who picked the map. And yeah, um. Eco won't matter. I mean, not eco. I mean, farms won't matter if we have like 5,000 eco max aircrafts. And then, yeah, okay. Yeah, even sheep lagged out of Battle TV. That's funny, to be honest. So, it's 3 at the moment. Ryan got hit by Karma. His favourite map DCs him. As it DCs everyone on a phone, we'll say. I remember when Agent Sensation... No, actually, I remember when Ryan... Um, when Ryan lagged out agent sensation on, on inlets and he was raging and now ryan's raging so it's kind of karma not gonna lie so on this one i'm gonna assume he's going dartland so i'm going cobra i don't think his dartland can beat my cobra because um i've seen lokish 
play against Ryan's Cobra. Pretty list. Not gonna lie. And my plan is just um adjust round 18 plus offensive push mode. I'm spiking here. So yeah, um I can't really remember what happens actually. So he's sending the sad face. I think he's still mad about the endless game, but like again, it's, it's kind of karma. I see. Um, I see he's lagged out other people before. Um, so he's upgraded his powerful darts. That's fine, and he's sending me some eco. I think he's. I think he's planning on playing mix eco style. Can't really remember too much. Yeah, so it's round four and he doesn't have his plantation. And we have five life cures, which is nice. So what you want to do now since um Ryan's since at the moment Ryan isn't sending me anymore, so I'm not equal at all. I'm just um I'm just Cobra farming. And yeah. Ryan should go for his plantation right now. Yep, so he goes for his plantation round 5, that's nice, nice, nice. And... Yeah, okay, so I'm gonna send some blacks on round 6 and some greens as well. And, um, he's still sending me some... Actually, he's not, I can't really tell. I think that's actually the AI. To be honest. And I think he rage quits. Oh, actually, no, he lags out. Well, he, he lagged out or rage quit, I'm not sure. Since he's 3 0 down, he's, he's not. He's he's not going to come back. Um, yeah, to be honest, I think he. I, th I think personally, I think he raged quit. But, um, yeah. If he lagged out. That's unfortunate, but I wasn't experiencing any lag. And Ryan's just a bit salty right now. Never mind, it's fine. So, it's pretty unlucky to Ryan. He lagged out twice, but Inlet was calmer. And um, I think on offside, he rage quit. That's, yeah. Ryan has won every single COD series, though in season six so i think he's a he's a decent contender for the season six king he hasn't um won any seasons yet so i'm hoping that he'll win season six thanks for watching everyone make sure to subscribe to to mr mahalik and mr chess see you guys yeah i like it's a black screen right now what you're seeing but i hope you can still hear me Peace.